Welcome to Yellowcard TCG. Zistral here bringing you my vlog of the Pokemon European International Championships. This is actually my first time back at a big Pokemon tournament since like 2011, 2012. It was really cool to see, you know, to be back in the scene again. Uh, yeah, here it is, me at the event. Thursday night, picking up badges, loads of people around, seeing both new and old faces alike. Funny vlog, right? These guys are all wise players. <laughs> I was absolutely blown away at the scale that they put on, how many players were there, how many people were there. It was just super cool compared to like Vanguard or like any Weiss or anything else I've seen before. I don't speak German, what do I do? Unlucky. Learn German. Yeah, just learn, jump. <laughs> <laughs> Okatash here, everyone knows this lovely face. How are we doing, guys? He's spectating, not playing, but uh, how have you found today? Really good, to be fair. I mean, it's obviously um, the scale of it is uh, from the playing area, it's very similar to Worlds. Um, mm -hmm. The whole venue itself, though, is using less space. Pokemon Center is really great as well, and the vibe here is absolutely amazing. Yeah, it is similar yeah. to Worlds, so I'm really impressed at how there's a positive vibe around, um, there's so many people, it's buzzing, and a lot of people from around the globe have come here. I've got friends from Australia, mm. Germany, you know, um, the USA, all competing, so yeah, yeah, yeah. really good. Um, good luck to everyone taking part. Hope you all get your qualifications for Worlds. Um, yeah, so yeah, great right. Thanks very much. Take care. Round three ended, lunch break, We're going into round four. We are almost all 2-1. Almost. One almost. Two, yeah. All right, time to, time to lose the next two rounds and no, go no, get- and Just win the next win the rounds. Win the next five rounds. Yeah. Easy, easy, easy. Easy. And then the IDI, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Easy, easy. Here with uh, Ben Kozas, all the way from Australia. Sure. I yeah. did just lose to this guy, but he was a very good player, very tight game, very enjoyable. How are you feeling today? I loved it. Yeah, the, it was an intense game. There's nothing more satisfying than actually just playing a really good, intense game. Um, I mean, I was the victor. I'm happy about that, but I've been on the other side. And when it's a tight game, like you can be proud of every like moment of it. Yeah, absolutely. So we got to win the rest of the rounds and carry my tiebreakers. Yeah. I, I hope so. Yeah, it's just a hard record. I'm um, three, one now. So three, three more to go. Three more wins. There you go. Yeah, it'll be huge. Any shout outs you want to make to your, like, your local community, whatever? Like you're from like Melbourne, right? From Melbourne. I'm here with a bunch of our local guys. There's a, I think three of them from our local community. Um, but yeah, we run a Facebook group, um, Playing Pokemon TCG Melbourne. Um, play, po playing. playing Pokemon TCG Melbourne. Yep, yep. Um, and we just sort of help look up, uh, hype up local events, uh, grassroots sort of stuff. Um, and it's a great community. I mean, feel free to join and see what is happening around the world. Awesome, thanks very much, man. Good Cheers. luck the rest of your games. Thank you. I ended up not doing very well in the main event, but I was already here for the whole weekend, so I tried to make the most of it. It is very early on Saturday morning. Uh, since my last update, I ate a lot of shit, lost a lot of rounds, uh, didn't draw Colras's experiment at all. So yeah, last night I had food and we just ended up signing up for the cup today. We'll see how that goes. Managed to squeeze in for a very early morning Pokemon Center appointment with a friend. So thanks to Richard from my local Rule Zero community for letting us tag along. Saw a lot of really cool stuff. My bank account wouldn't let me buy too much. So I just walked away with a few small exclusive bits and pieces. You know, you right there? Yeah, just uh, dropped from League Cup. <laughs> Bricks, so yeah, it happens. Yeah. I've been wasting my money outside. I have a coffee and we're just wait, waiting until GLC, right? Oh, uh, Bandon. Yes. Hell yeah. 
Does, it, that, does that pretty much sum up how your day yesterday pretty, went? Pretty much, yep. This is the first time I've ever had my name uh, incorrectly written on a Starbucks cup after several Starbucks. I feel like it's hard names to get wrong, right? So you've got some stuff from the Pokemon Center as well? Yeah. I've got socks over. Check it. Socks. Socks. Hell yeah. They run out of exclusive stuff, so I just have to get stuff that looks nice. So, dropping from Cup because I ate shit there as well. Playing in GLC, borrowing Nico's deck. Having played all of what? Four games of GLC in my life and I just won round one. So yeah, easy. This man apparently won in two turns. Yeah, I did. It was a two-turner. He had nothing. He played dragons. And it was like the saddest game I ever had. There is nothing more to say. I don't, I don't want to say anymore because I can't... I can't, um, can't be respectful. Yeah. 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 Right. <laughs> so it's three rounds best of one, which is pretty cool. So we'll see how it goes. And then it's six hours. We're done with day two. Well, none of us played day two. We all played GLC. <laughs> this man goes 3 0. I went 2 1. The guy whose deck I borrowed also went 2 1. Now we're getting food. How's, how's your day? My day did it all right. It's been pretty good. Yeah. Bomb so many tickets. So, after redeeming myself in GLC, me and a few friends, we went to get food. We went to watch the Mario movie. And then we came back on Sunday morning, you know, just to keep experiencing some more GLC and more of the event. So here it is. Day Sunday, yeah, day three, round one. Sign up for GLC again, and I'm up against round one. Hello, rule zero member. <laughs> Father down tables is another rule zero team kill. Very sad. Yeah, see how it goes. I went 3-0 in that pod, and then 2-1 in the second pod of the day. So total final score of 7-2 in GLC. And then me and a few friends, we sat down to just watch the finals at the end of the day. And that's the end of EUIC. Really cool event, really well put together. Thank you so much to everyone I met and everyone I know from the game. Just being part of the community was very, very cool. And hopefully I'll see some of you at the next major event. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.